Now, Brazilian athlete Jacqueline Morau is competing in her second Beijing Olympics, having now taken part in both 2008 and 2022. The 46-year-old is a cyclist, biathlete and cross-country skier, and her experience is inspiring young sportswomen in her home country. CGTN's Zhao Yunfei met up with her to learn more. You participated eight Olympics, five Winter Games and three Summer Games. I'm wondering which Olympics really impressed you most? Oh, it's a, a tough question. I think I'm a passionate about the Olympic movement and uh, every single Olympic has a meaning to me. I really never thought about Winter Games until May 2005, I saw this snowstorm and uh, I was already biking, already doing races in North, North America and then uh, all of a sudden I could not bike. I just felt in love with the nature, up and down, the cross-country skis it has a lot to do with mountain biking. Each Olympics has his own special thing for sure. Absolutely. What was your impression on Beijing Games the 14 years ago in 2008? I was very excited. I get to bike around the city and see the markets and everything. And uh, what I like, it was part of the culture. I was seeing the, the people and enjoying when I get to know that uh, Beijing is going to be again uh, an Olympic game. It was very interesting. <laughs> But this time you won't be able to, um, you know, wander around. So uh, is there a way that you can make it up? Of course, I arrived in the airport. I was searching all these memories, all this time, that good time that I had here. And uh, I felt really happy to be back here and uh, to exchange with the people. We see the, the people who work on the cleaning, the, on, on the cafeteria, on the venues. Everybody's so kind, everybody's doing so much their best. I think it was a very challenging Olympics to organize with pandemic situation. When you were searching your memories, definitely 14 years has passed. What has changed? What has not? I could not see the city, but uh, in the opening ceremony, I saw the venues that I know, the nest and the swimming, but I saw the other technology and the opening ceremony was astonished. I was so impressed, so beautiful. Mm -hmm. I know that you were thinking about retirement after the Tokyo Games, but now you carry it on for another year and make it to Beijing. Was it because of your experience back in Beijing in 2008? And do you think that you have very special emotional contacts with Beijing? Yeah, it's kind of, I wanted to, to share this history, this historic moment for Beijing to, to host the only city that hosts winter and summer. And in, in a way, I'm kind of dreaming with you guys and being here like a few athletes was able to be in this both. What is it like to be, I call it a dual Olympic athlete? I mean, how do you handle both? <laughs> Does it mean tighter uh, preparation cycle? Well, it was uh, a challenge. I would not say that was not a challenge. Uh, to be summer and winter athlete, you have to have uh, two blocks very different in your preparation in four years. I love to learn. I love to get better human being. I love to discover new things. So this is my drive. You just said that you're a history maker. You must be a very good role model for a lot of people back in your home country. How would you inspire the next generation of athletes in Brazil, especially those young ladies? I'm a normal person who worked hard to be here. My history inspired the, the other girls and uh, in whatever they want to achieve, yes, they can do it. And uh, they are allowed to dream and I hope they, they, they do even better than what I did. Well. Olympics is all about competition, but at the same time, it's also about friendship. And you said that you are a veteran uh, Olympian. You certainly have experience uh, more than anyone else. So what's your understanding of the uh, Olympic spirit? Well, it's so, of course, everybody's here to do their best, their excellence. And every day, like, of course, we have only three medals. But uh, for me, they are all champions. They are all here and they, are, they all win. And sport gave me everything. Gave me 
so much experiences, so much life to the friendship and the excellence. Everybody's here to, to share this, uh, this moment.